No, I'm gonna bring the shotgun. I can waste a few shells on zombies. It's not like I'm running low yet. Yet. Alright, we're good to go. I'm pumped. My shotgun. And I'm ready to explode right in someone's face. Those stairs look very unappetizing. That zombie looks very unappetizing. Fire extinguisher? No, I guess you don't want that. Door. You want door. And what is in the door? Or past the door? This room's dark. Let's flick on the light switch. Hey, green herb. Gimme, gimme, gimme. I actually know what that says, but I'm going to pretend I don't. <gasps> handgun ammo? Heck yeah. For the handgun, I will not use that much anymore. Okay. Maybe if you keep giving me ammo. Oh. Researcher's letter. June 8th, 1998. Dear Ada. Ada, by the time you read this, I'll be something different. Today's test turned out to be positive, just as I expected. I feel like going crazy when I think about becoming one of them. Ada, you're not infected, and I hope you never will be. In case you're the last one left, take the material in the visual data room and go to the power room to operate the trigger system before you escape, and make all of this public through the media. If everything is in order, all the locks can be opened by the security system. You can access the system if you log in with my name from the terminal in the small lab and enter the password. The password is your name. To unlock the door at B2, where the visual data room is located, you'll need to access with our names first and then enter another password. I've written the code below. I'm sure you'll understand it easily. And this is my last hope. If you find me completely changed, please kill me yourself. Yours, John. Oh, I wonder what the password could be. Also, push this switch. It's important. Blue light. And suddenly everything makes sense. Now we just need to cross-reference this with that letter. Where did you go? Oh, I think I missed one. I think the last one's an M, but that's just me taking wild guess here. Do to do. It's an L. It's an A. Oh, the M is an E. So the password is mail. And I'm not going to turn off the light. I'm fine with the mansion, but this place, no. I'm going to rack up your electricity bills. Jerk. Maybe I do. No, I don't. Fine. Go the other way. This is about the whole electricity thing, isn't it? Now you're mad at me, so you're electronically locking everything to get in my way. Ugh, zombie. Ugh, more zombie. Ah, zombie everywhere. I'm running out of ammo. No, I'm not. 
Okay, I really cannot tell where the hell everything is at this point. Uh, camera angles are changing way too fast. Let's go around this way. Oh, what are you? Hooray! Vacation slides! I wonder where they're from. <laughs> I don't know, I think those look like pretty special equipment to me. Maybe this is stuff you see every day, Chris, but... Alright, it's hacking time! And this is actually done in a pretty interesting way. No. Chris is like, oh, what do I do? And I tell him. And then... I tell him again. He's like, bam. He's also very bad at typing. So he used to smack each key like it was on a typewriter. But I think he presses the appropriate keys, which is interesting. Oh no, permission denied. Chris is like, oh, what was that word? I can't quite remember it. Was it my gender? I think so. Damn! Break something, Chris. You're angry. Oh, maybe it was... Was it Ada again? Okay, let's try that. Damn! Punch the computer, Chris. Alright, can we open basement three? <laughs> Woohoo! Thumbs up. And all that good stuff. Well... <sighs> We'll get back to the basement two later. As I read the file more thoroughly, which I'm going to do right now. <laughs> 